Good morning, everybody. This is Oscar here once again. Uh, so, anyways, today is I'm just gonna give you guys a little, uh, a little tour of what we're doing today. It's a little early morning for me. I'm actually here getting some coffee here at Cafino, so which is like my Mexican Starbucks, right? As close as I can get to Mexican Starbucks. Uh, but, anyways, um, take my wife and my daughter to get her to get their nails done at the pedicure. So I'm just killing some time right now, uh, and. We're gonna go ahead and get something to eat today. So we're gonna go ahead and see what we're gonna eat. Something something different today. I mean, not not no tacos, you know what I mean? I think I'm tired of tacos every day. <laughs> but anyways, guys, follow us along and uh, follow us along to see what we kind of, kind of trouble we get into, what we get into, all right, guys? So follow us through and we'll be back. I got these coffees for these ladies. I got uh, two brocachinos, which is like nice coffee. And then a uh, chai food for the girls that's on her nails. And I got me a dirty chai. No, mine's bigger than all the other ones. <laughs> that's what's up. <laughs> all right, so I'm going to give this to the ladies. What's up? I'm going to walk while I'm waiting right there for my wife and my daughter to finish their nails. I've got to walk to this local OXO and uh, make a few payments. Early in the morning, you got the guys sending the frutas. And uh, yeah, so that's what we're gonna be heading to. Look at the exchange rate. The exchange rate is 1750 and then 765. That's if you wanna sell your dollars at the top and if you wanna buy dollars at the bottom. So I'm gonna walk through this little colonia called La Cacho. All right, so I had to pause the video because when you cross the streets here in TJ, it's, it's no joke. <laughs> Actually, if, if you see someone walking and people see someone walking, they just gas it. Not me, of course not me, right? I'm, I'm, come on now, guys. I drive too, but I don't treat other people like that. But if you guys live in TJ, you guys already know. When you're trying, trying to cross the street, you got to look, look four ways because not once, but twice, maybe three times because these cars, they just want to be taking everybody. But anyways, I'm walking through this little cool neighborhood. It's a nice little neighborhood right here. It's called La Cacho. Colonial Cacho is pretty cool. It's like a business business and small homes so homes that build into businesses and some more other uh, bigger buildings so but anyways it's a, it's a nice colonia really nice colonia all right so i'm gonna go and turn the camera on so you guys can see all right look so this this is what i mean like industrial see, see the big old house right there it's like a it's like kind of like apartments right like fancy apartments and then you have a private school over there and then this is like a warehouse and then some type of house over there and then you have a big house right there and then uh kind of like an alleyway because it's a little little close to the street with apartments houses you know and then some more business over there it's a very 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 busy street here uh as you can see some more businesses up there so it's about bakery some fancy old bakery anyways i'm just gonna go ahead and make it to the oxo and i gotta make some payments so well i gotta make some payments at the oxo so this is the way we pay our bills in Mexico. We go through Oxo. This is the other side. We're going to that Oxo. I don't know if you guys can see it with a big old tree over there, but that's what we're heading on to. Like another nice apartment. And this is uh, like a little castillo. What's it called like a, a salon for events. Events hall, what do you want to call it? Oh, look at this Maserati. I'll show you guys that green building right there. The greenhouse looks like a little, uh, I want to say, it's not Victorian style. I don't think it's Victorian. I think it's more like French colonial style. Again, I'm not an architect, so I don't know. I probably fell asleep during that class during school. <laughs> and then look, this is what I mean by teachers always blooming. All right, check it out. See that big old building over there? Those are going to be like uh, penthouses style buildings, and they're going to be pretty expensive. But anyway, so see, that's what I mean by Tijuana's always blooming. And then we have the world famous Tijuana burritos and every corner there's always some lady or some guy selling burritos. And we finally made it to the Oxo, so we're gonna cross the street right here, guys. We're gonna use a crosswalk. Uh, if there's any, but I don't think there's any crosswalks, so we're just gonna go ahead and take it. All right, let's go. All right, so I just left little Oxo, my little uh, trusted convenience store. Was well, not always trusted because sometimes the systems are down and it sucks when you can't make your payments. But anyways, I just made my payment right now. I had to pay my electricity and my internet. So those two are paid. Now, normally we go to uh, every OXO to make the payments because if you go to the, uh, the electricity place to make the payment, it sucks. Like sometimes, I would, last time I went to them, they actually were, all the machines were down. So I couldn't pay for it there. So I had to wait to another OXO and it was anyways. So anyways, it's more convenient just to make the payments all at once instead of just going to different places. Like for example, I had to pay the internet right now 
and electricity. I didn't want to go to two different places. So that's why I just paid there, you know what I mean? But yeah. All right guys, so I made it back to the car and I'm just waiting for the wifey to get out of that jealous time right there so we can go in and uh, take off and get something to eat. I'm hella starving right now and I don't know what we're gonna eat. So, I mean, I don't really want tacos to be honest with you. I know my wife probably be like, oh, tacos. You know what I mean? <laughs> but I want something better. I want something like a burger or a sandwich. You know what I mean? Something good. Something something really good. You know what I mean? I'm not saying like a ham sandwich. I'm talking about like a Subway, but not really Subway. You know what I mean, right? So anyways, uh, we're going to go ahead and wait for my wifey to go ahead and finish her nails did and my daughter to get her nails done. And uh, I'll be right back with you guys. All right, let's go. All right, so we finally got this one out of the, the, the salon. Show me your nails, little girl. Ooh, get cute. Look at those. Okay, black and white. All right, cool. Let me see your toes. They're just black. <laughs> They're just black. That's it. Yeah. That's it. Okay. So Those don't. Are dirty. Don't show that. All right. So she did a, a full petty and a full mani with gel. Um, show me your receipt. I'm <laughs> like, all right. So this is the Mexican prices. All right. So this is again. This is a full jelly, full jellish. I guess that's language on both feet and hands. Yeah, it's gel. All right. So let's look at this. All right. So look, 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 look. It's now some 315 pesos, which is approximately 75 bucks since the dollars are 1752. So it's approximately, uh, what, like 75 bucks. Earlier it was a 1750, so it jumped two cents. All right, so my baby girl's already out of the, the little chair. So I want to see her nails. Let me see your toenails, baby. Over here, over here, over here, no, over here. Get toes. your ass over here. Hey, look at that. Get cute. <laughs> Hey, get your ass away. Quit being shy. No, I have see. finger toes. No. Nah, let me see your... <laughs> if you have finger toes, then why you get them done? Because they have to be cute. That was nice. Let me see. This is going to back up over here. Back it. Mm -hmm. Come on, go. Hurry up. Alright, so now show me how much you paid. Okay, so anyways. She paid thirteen oh five, which is about also the same thing, 75 bucks. For both. For both. Feet and toes. What do you mean, babe? Faux. Faux? Papusas. No, papusas is on way back home. Uh, Don't. Nice. I have no makeup. Who cares? Between Cyprus, Wild Cyprus, and Carl's Jr. I don't know. So we're just choosing which one. <laughs> Wild Cyprus it is. These are the agua frescas that we got. This one is pineapple with jengibre. And then this one is pepino with menta. This is what our little tap looking like. Those two, those, this one is a combo and this one's a combo. This one's just a sandwich by itself. And they come up to 489 pesos, which is about like 28 bucks, give or take. This one's a tuna sandwich. This one's a, a chipotle sandwich. You get some chips. And then this one is a cypress sandwich. It's similar to a chipotle, it's just a little more spicy. All right, guys, so just a little update. I just dropped off the wifey and my daughter to the border. They're going to go ahead and walk across in today because, uh, anyways, we're walking today. But I'm stuck in traffic and it's raining, so it's going to take me a minute to get home. I still got to go to the gym and do a little workout. So, yeah, that's what we're working on, all right? So let's just keep on traveling. Let's get this traffic out of the way. Let's go. All right, what's up, everybody? So I just made it here uh, to my gym, and I'm going to go ahead and... Uh, get situated because it's raining out there so i'm just gonna get my stuff and try not to get wet i didn't check the weather but it is what it is to one has some crazy ass weather so anyways i'm gonna go ahead of the gym today is leg day with triceps and shoulders so it's, let's get it on all right guys so let's do this let's go so this is this is the back of the gym that i go to this is the crossfit section it's pretty cool it's got this bunch of uh hanging monkey hanging tools there Nice big mirror spinning right there. And then you got a little boxing bag right there. Back from the triceps, some more monkey bars. Yeah, so it's pretty cool. All right, so like I said, I'm gonna be doing triceps, legs, and shoulders. Um, so that's what we got for today. The plan, the, today is actually the last day of my uh, bulking diet. So no more 30 bulking for me. As you can see, my little cheeks are getting a little tubby here. So yeah, today's the last day of that diet and the workout. Starting Monday, I start a new workout session which is gonna be crossfit i'm gonna i still wanna add some weights to it but i think i'm gonna incorporate bodybuilding or weightlifting with crossfit but the main focus is gonna be crossfit 
all right so what's up everybody so i just made it home home sweet home it's hella dark and it's raining so yeah that was my whole day i've been out since what 10 30 in the morning and it's barely what 8 30 a night wait it's traffic is crazy in tj but i'm just gonna go home well i'm already home so i'm just gonna stay here now and enjoy the rest of the night with my boys hot huh, boys yeah. that's right either, either way though this is my view right now hello rufus how are you how are you hey Get your ass inside. Come on, go inside. What's up, little guy? Hi. Is that how you say hi to your dad? Uh, hi, father. <laughs> Where's my other child? I said that's in the bathroom. What's up, child? What are you doing? Why is it dark in here? Oh, old lady, calm down, old lady. All right, guys, well, thank you guys for uh, watching this video with us today. Thank you guys for uh, coming through and uh, watching this entire video. For those who you guys did watch the entire video, thanks for the support. Now, I'll see you guys in the next video, right? So, you guys exactly what's, what's been going on here with everybody and everything. It's just been so hectic. So, finally, I'm able to post the video and give you guys an update.